Are you quarantined? Are you bored? But you have a Nintendo Switch? Good, because in this video, I'm going to show you guys top five Nintendo Switch games that I personally recommend you check out and put many, many, many hours into. Starting off at number five is new Super Lucky's Tale. So if you're looking for an indie game that gives you all kinds of Crash Bandicoot, uh, Sonic the Hedgehog, and Mario vibes, then this is the one for you. This is one of those indie games that when you play it, it doesn't really feel like an indie game, but rather it feels like a AAA title. You can tell by the amazing people over at Playful Studios really put a lot of time and effort into working this here. I mentioned this game a couple of times on my channel and a few on my Instagram. So if you guys haven't heard of this before, or maybe you are looking for a game that really just blows away the title of indie, then this is the one I highly recommend you check out. Number four, we have Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team Deluxe. Man, what a mouthful of a title. This is a game that I personally really like to play. Granted, it's different from the other Pokemon games, but at the end of the day, folks, is a Pokemon game. Is it different? Yes, but you know what? It's a remade of an old Game Boy Advance game that is remade for the Switch. It still has the RPG elements, just a little bit tweaked. This sits perfectly for any Pokemon fans, and I myself have put lots of hours into this. At number three is Luigi's Mansion 3. So this game came out last year, actually, during Halloween, and a perfect time if you ask me. But nevertheless, this title deserves to be on this list to me personally because Luigi's Mansion 3, to me personally, was one of the best games I ever played. Same script, different title, same game. Rescue Mario, hunt down ghosts, control the man himself, Luigi! I wasn't expecting to love it as much as I did. So, and when it first came out, I was just hooked automatically, okay? So, for a game that you didn't expect to love so much and did, let's just get lost into a haunted mansion or hotel and just game away. At number two is Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. So this was actually the very first Nintendo Switch game I ever played. And I personally love it still to to this day. And I recommend it for everybody. Why? Cause it's Mario Kart. Who doesn't love Mario Kart? I feel as if by law, you have to have a Mario Kart game for any Nintendo console to me personally. That's just how I look at it, okay? What better way to practice social distance with some online races with your pals on Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, making them eat your dust. For example, teach you, just saying. And finally, at number one is none other than Animal Crossing New Horizons. Man, you guys already know why this had to be on the list and why it is number one, okay? I already did a first impressions. I already did a full review of this awesomeness right here, okay? So need I explain more why this is the number one pick for quarantine gaming? Hmm? Well, for those who are wondering, listen, these times, can, they can be stressful. I cannot lie, okay? It can be stressful. And with Animal Crossing New Horizons, guys, what separates this from most games is that unlike other games, which you have to be competitive and so high energy and focused, this one, you can just relax. You don't need to be stressed now. You just build a city with a village full of so adorable animals that treat you with love and care and all is well there. You just get lost into the world of Animal Crossing and you just forget about the real world until you turn off your switch, that is. But nonetheless, Animal Crossing New Horizons, guys, if you wanna put your mind at ease and still get your gaming on, I highly recommend you check out Animal Crossing New Horizons, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. Please comment, share, give this video a huge thumbs up, and of course, subscribe for more. <gasps> and with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, God, spare my guardians. Later.